Hi, I'm Joel. And I'm Rita. And we're the Weebners. Um, we're going to give you a tour of our gallery today and uh, show you a little bit about where we work and, and what we do in a day. The whole building's filled with other creatives. Um, there's a graphic designer right in the front here. Upstairs is the Lancaster Symphony Orchestra um, and a uh, architectural, an architectural design um, company. Uh, so it's, it's really cool to kind of be in a building with a bunch of other people who are, you know, like-minded. So. Right. so we're going to take you inside. Come on in. This is the art gallery area right in front of our space. Uh, so every time clients come through, they walk through this space and kind of get the sense that, oh, this is like a cool art space. We really like the first impression that you get, or clients get walking through the, uh, the art gallery coming in here so that they know that we're not your standard photographer. Um, it's much better than, you know, being in a mall or something like that. Right. We want to give the first impression that we're uh, creative, that we're artistic, uh, and, and that the, should give them that when they walk through here. Right. So. All right. Well, this, this is our space. Um, we moved in here about a year and a half ago, and we're pretty happy with it. We, uh, when we moved in here, there wasn't a whole lot going on. It was, it was just sort of, well, it is still white walls, but we painted all the walls again. Right. So um, we brighten it up and make it really really white. Yeah, but it sort of had like an office feel to it. We put up these um, window thingies from Ikea. There's a big blue wall actually behind the camera that you can't see. Um, but the, uh, the whole point here was to hang as much work as we possibly could. And we wanted to all have it look good next to each other, um, including looking good with the furniture and everything that was in, the, in their space. So um, when we, before we even moved in here or painted or anything, we photoshopped every wall. I made that wall blue. I hung the prints that I think we were going to put up there on it. Um, every single wall and what items were going to go there right. were, were um, photoshopped together. So we, we mocked up everything. Um, even the couch, we, we pretty much knew the couch that we were going to get. Right. Well, we didn't have time to do like get an interior designer or like really didn't have the money because we had a ton of stuff we wanted to buy for here. So uh, this was like our second best thing. We knew what colors we wanted to go with, so we started there and um, you know the rest of it just followed. Yeah, and it, it was it was cool because most of the stuff we bought online, um, other than like the the big furniture, and we just put it all together in uh, mock-ups, and we knew exactly how it was going to look. We wanted to make sure everything worked real well, so we laid it out in Photoshop, and it all looked really good. Then we hung it up on the wall. It wasn't something that we just ordered our favorite prints. We have a lot of stuff hung. Um, we want to hang as much stuff as we can. We like to rotate as much as we can too. Um, so all of the canvases in here, um, they're all from Simply Canvas, and we made most of it in, in one big order. There's a gallery hanging system in here. So these actually slide back and forth. They're, they're sort of like screws on a, in a slot. Um, behind you here, these are hung with a wire that actually goes up into the rail that goes all the way around the room. Yeah, the cool thing is we can swap things around. We, can, we don't have to hang prints in the same place or in the same configuration. This allows us to not have to put a million holes in the wall and have this spackle, spackle and paint all the time. This is our office. It's a mess. It is a mess. But it's not it's, that bad. It's, it's not that bad. We cleaned up. Um, this, is, this is Kingston. Everybody should have a Kingston. Yes, we recommend it highly. He's our assistant, associate photographer, babysitter, all around, do whatever you want to person. So we have a... Uh, we have a, have a G5, an iMac, Rita's laptop that we take home every night. Our children's artwork hanging all <laughs> over the place. So we bring the art clients in. They sit down right here. Um, we get them comfortable. We offer coffee, tea. Uh, our, our goal is to have them just feel like they're sitting in our living room. That's why there's a couch here. That's, you know, it's not, it, we don't want an office feel. We don't want, you know, anything but what's going to make them comfortable. Right. Um, we sit and chat for hopefully a half an hour or At more. At least a half an hour, just about them, um, you know, about if we don't, If we don't talk about the wedding, I don't care. Um, if we come up with similar things that, you know, if, if we're talking about similar interests, that's, you know, that's much better. We just kind of chat and, you know, they nobody ever pushes us hard, let's see a wedding. And if they do start pushing us through wedding stuff and albums, then right. probably not our client. Right. Um, uh, we're looking for a really specific type of people, um, you know, ones that really want to form a relationship with us, not ones just looking for the cheapest photographer around. So, uh, you know, we try to find out as much information as we can about them, you know, how they got engaged, how they met, 
their pretty much their entire history as much as they're willing to give us. So. Yeah, most people love sharing the story how they got engaged, and, and that's an obvious, easy starting spot. Thanks for watching our tour of our studio. If you have any questions, um, if you like want to know anything about any of the canvases or any of the way we designed the space, anything like that, uh, you can email us or you can check out the blog, which yep. is theweblog.com, uh, or you can attend one of our workshops or see us at one of our speaking engagements. So. Sure. Or just drop us uh, an email, um, info at theweebners.com. Right. All right. Thanks, Thanks a lot.